He ain't gonna do it. Tell y'all right now, he ain't gonna do it. Hold on, let me find me something over here. Uh, let's see. We got. It. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Hold on. I need to. He ain't gonna do it. Oh, my goodness. He ain't gonna do it. Would she catch her boyfriend cheating with another girl from the club? Man, he ain't gonna do it. Let's find out. Now you can do it, y'all. We ain't finna waste no time. Hit that like button, subscribe if y'all new. What is the UDY? Or oh, this is Jack TV. This is Jack TV. Jack TV. Thanks for the thanks for the video, Jack. This is Jack TV. Alright. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Welcome back to another episode on Jack TV. Today, Cheyenne wants to put her boyfriend back to the local test to see if he was true love to her or not. So, nice to meet you, Cheyenne. Uh, this is Gabe. He's my security. You know what I'm saying? I'm behind the camera or whatever. Um, what stood out to me about your story is basically that you left your home, home in Mississippi, came out here, was with your boyfriend for seven months. You're alone. You have no family out here. And for him to switch up on you like that, can you kind of go into more detail about like why? You got to this point. Thanks to Cheyenne, we knew that Stag was celebrating his 25th birthday at Dome, giving us the perfect window of opportunity to test his loyalty. He used to take me out with him all the time, and now he's just like, he's been changing up. Like, he's barely answering the phone, he's barely um, texting me back when he go out with his homeboys and stuff. So, my intuition just telling me that he cheated. Straight to the point. So, um, outside of his homeboys, do y'all have mutual friends? Like, when he's doing shit and you at home, do you have things to do, or did you meet new people? From being out here? Yeah, I have a few friends from uh, being out in the club, but we don't have any mutual friends. First red flag was the fact that Cheyenne's boyfriend did not invite her out to celebrate his 25th birthday. However, he could have just wanted to do something with his friends and afterwards do something more intimate with her alone. But that still didn't rub Cheyenne the right way. Okay, so outside of him just not inviting you out, are there any other red flags? Yeah, the red flag is basically it's supposed to be his birthday weekend. He's supposed to be going out. He, he didn't invite me out with him. He, he didn't say I could come with him for his birthday, so, yeah, so. But did he tell you not to come? Well, he said it's just him and his boy, so uh, I guess no girls allowed. So I don't know. Like, it's kind of weird. How does it even make sense? It is weird. So he went and yeah, went yeah, 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 yeah. his birthday. Do you know where uh, I think they're going to be at oh. Dome. That's the name of the club, so. Okay. So, uh, what we can do, um, if you want to do something close to his birthday or on his birthday, you just have to send me those details and we okay. just try to draw some up to try to see if we can execute the test or not. Okay. Um, if you have any questions for me, you can have time to just go ahead and get rid of the or any concerns, even if you don't want to do it no more, just let me know what's up. And this is how we came up with the idea of Cheyenne gifting her boyfriend transportation for that night. The plan was for Cheyenne to tell Stag that the transportation that she rented out was for him and his friends to get home safe because she didn't want him out driving and being intoxicated. Oh, how come every time we go to Atlanta, bro? Like, come on, bro. So, y'all, look, we just left Atlanta. We had a consultation with somebody and we flew out there for no reason because I don't feel like they're going to do it. But good thing about tonight, we got a meeting with Cheyenne and we're going to execute a test tonight uh, with her boyfriend Stag with we ain't going to Atlanta no more, man. At all, man. Hey. Yeah, we good, man. What's up, bro? 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did you try to do it already? <laughs> 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 nah, look, just got him out. Got him on my video, just keep the link in, in it or whatever. Wait, down. Alright, alright. Yeah, you yeah, got him to me. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I might, hey, keep going. I might use that, bro. Back to back. Oh, old, oh, no, bro. But the plan was to actually get our decoy to go to his station and make her way on the van so she can actually test his loyalty. So tonight we're connecting his loyalty test, and this is actually the first time that Cheyenne and think? Mike have been. What y'all think? What y'all think?
Decoy actually get to meet. So we're gonna go ahead and discuss the do's and don'ts like we always do. Cheyenne, this is Micah. Micah, this is Cheyenne. She will be playing Decoy for today's video. So now this is the perfect time where you can tell her what she can and cannot do while she's conducting the test. Well, basically, I mean, I don't have no, um, no limits. You can do anything. I don't care, girl. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I just want to see if you're gonna fall for it. Okay. So before I reached out to you earlier today, I was actually thinking about going into the club and conducting it here only because um, the fact that he might be intoxicated or under the influence, it may like the integrity of the taste. So you don't really drink that much, but he, he, he probably drinks some, but he probably won't be drunk though. He okay. Based on what he do, like how much would you blame on the liquor? You feel like when you go in, he's gonna be a section 26. All you're gonna do is approach him, and you gotta act like you're just a party girl. You know what I mean? Go up to him, you know what I'm saying? Flirt with him, make make sure he knows that you're not that you're feeling like he's attracted to you. Yeah, and then you know, yeah, try to go home with him on some group shit. Okay, that's what I'm saying. 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 Okay, that's Ah. He's a big boy. Boom. I stopped and I went to sleep. I wake up the next morning. They don't believe me. That's cool. Good, easy, something. All right. All right, back to the action. And right and failed by making a pass at our decoy on his birthday. Let's find out now. So you guys, stag section was already full, according to what our decoy came back and told us. After sending Micah in the club, she texted us and informed us that his section was already full and it was very hard to actually get to him. And according to his Instagram story, it wasn't hard to see that. So we waited a couple hours outside of the club, you guys waiting on stag and his friends to come outside. Because Micah wasn't able to make her move inside of the club on stag, this is our only opportunity to make her move right now so we can see where this goes. Huh. Excuse me. Excuse hey, you good? How you doing? I see you in the club. I was trying to see. What y'all? My friends dish me. They dish you. Yeah, like you know how you be. You ain't got what you ready to go. No, but you really too bad. I don't know, but like what y'all? This your man? Yeah, this my man. Oh, what's up? Yeah, oh, yeah. This my, this my own you trying to, you trying to, you trying to slide Is your sprinter? Yeah, we're trying to go to the after. I was trying to Oh, this sounds nice. I'm not. Kids, no. Oh, for sure, for sure. You about to go where? We're trying to go to the after. Yeah, for sure, for sure. I can look at y'all. Come on. Okay, then. Come on. Uh, so he, he, he brought it to the van. That was easy. It was an automatic fare for you, huh? Yeah. Oh, this is nice. I really got it. She said all night feels already, but she didn't know it's over with. But she, she a random. Oh. Technically. Oh. 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 Bro, not here. Not here. Not here. Not here. It's too easy, bro. Don't fuck with it, bro. It's too easy. What? The random ass cat just walked up. You gonna pick it up and take it home? Hey, no. <laughs> He's in the club for literally four hours. You want to know no hoes? I know it. No, 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 Man, yeah, my birthday is I, I really don't be celebrating until like this. Uh, I'm gonna get some food. Mm -hmm. Why don't you take a girlfriend and pick up some hoes at the same time? 
That's the smartest thing, man. Cause then she can pick with you. <laughs> She's like, uh uh. Oh, look, she bad. Come with us. Hey, uh, John. I need you to go ahead and slide to that Marriott, bro. It's about to fall, my dad. Huh? Wait, so. Marriott. He said he was going to the Marriott? Yeah, he didn't say nothing about going to the Marriott. He just said he was going out with his homeboys and going home. Marriott, the Marriott, the Marriott, the address that I sent you. What's up in the middle? You got what I'm saying? Good, it's crazy. Tonight, baby, baby, jumping over me tonight, not tonight. So I gotta worry about somebody knocking on your hotel room or something? Why would you have to worry about all this? I'm just saying, you look like you got, you know. Like I got what? Something going on. What about me makes you feel like You got a couple situations going on, but what like. What about me makes you feel like this? I don't know, you're just handsome. You're real handsome, but like... I don't even know why you playing with me like that. I'm saying, though. You single? I'm very much single. Like, so... Oh! Oh! That's why I asked you to get a problem with you. Oh, my God. Yeah, we just gonna close this up there. <laughs> so... Yeah, guys. You all right? Yeah. You good? Hey, Driver, hurry up. Oh. That was crazy. Hey, Driver, hurry up. My legs, but I might as well come up. I see you, huh? No, I mean, you can. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you take it. I know you don't, but see, it's your head. You're looking at yourself. So, answer my question, though, yes or no? About what? Like, is you completely, like, up for grass? I am completely. Up for grass. I don't have you right situation. You stop flexing. I'm not flexing. Relax, you are flexing. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> you got doubles? <laughs> Yo, you funny. <laughs> Yo, I ain't gonna lie. Look, check this out, bro. Because I ain't gonna lie. You damn near finna give me an anxiety attack. Oh, They're not here. You gotta find your own. <laughs> That's all right, you say. Yeah, I don't know why she keep asking me, do I got a girl? Bro, why? Well, he he don't got no girl. You don't care. You don't got no girl. I don't need to lie about nothing. I don't got no girl. No girl. I don't got no girl. I don't got no girl. I don't even play like that. I don't even play like that. I don't even play like that. We just gonna avoid that conversation because he your man, so he gonna ride for me. I ain't gonna no, it's, it's cool though. It's cool. Him himself, no, I ain't it's got right. no gal. It's alright. Him himself, it's no, okay. I don't it's, got no I mean, gal. It's alright. It's alright. I ain't gonna lie, uh, Miss Mike and Mike. Uh, Stay. What's up? What you trying to do? Uh, let me call you up in the wine glass and get you know, I really want to explain to you what you like. I apologize. Damn. I don't think you need no more. That's for me and you. Hey, you. Man, I'm just Dude, you. like, what is you got going on? Oh. You trying to turn me up for what? What you mean? You we trying to take me to the hotel? What you mean? Okay, and what's, what that mean? You got no type of time I was on. I was in the club. You not trying to fuck? This nigga trying to fuck. Nah, just pull this bitch over. Pull this bitch over right now. I'm, I'm ready to get out. Oh, damn. Yeah. That's crazy. We gotta wait to see where they're going though. We can see yes, where the we can see where the vibe like, like, yes, You go with Jessica. She's like, where this thing go? She's like, it's over. Oh, oh, Alright, so what if I said no? What if I said no? You gotta go. All right, and then when I pass I'm my number in the middle. Hey, driver. In the middle of the street. Oh, my daddy. Stop in the middle of the street. She got to get the fuck off. This your man? Right now. You, you condone this? Yay or nay? That's love. Yay or nay? Is you trying to put over you want to do? It's your will. See, this is what I'm saying. I love her. I love you. <laughs> I ain't going to lie. Yeah, we a man. I'm not taking this big ass. You got me fucked up. All right, well, then put something in my face. Okay, 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 okay. How about you? Are you from Houston? No, I'm from Michigan. Detroit. Are you from Detroit? Mm-hmm. Where you from? Oh, you from 
I mean, if you if that's what you wanna, I guess. Detroit, you can rap. Eight mile, no. Can you rap? I can rap. I'm rap. Like this on. I live. I live. I'm a singer. Get back to the all that. To the motherfucking Marriott. Oh look, little MK, I so what I'm about. Man, I'm about to spin that episode to get a penny. Okay. You already know, oh, oh, I'm about to end it. I already know, I'm about to leak on that pussy. What? You already know, it was wish, it was good. Shoot, please. All right, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. You want me to stay? Call me, eh? You see? How much you ain't? You kind of spinning. Yeah, they say I'm spinning it, you know? What you, how much you ain't on? Huh? Huh? <laughs> How much do you weigh? Okay. How much you weigh? Like one seventy? I ain't gonna lie, baby. You know what I'm saying. You know what I You saying baby boy? Yes. You know what that Melvin is? Yeah. Hey, <laughs> you think you baby boy? <laughs> so if I sit on you, I'm gonna be You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be hugging. I'm I'm trying to see what's going to happen when the girlfriend come in because this is crazy. Oh, man, she smells so good. Oh. What should you be wearing? It's your natural scent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. All right, uh. Oh, that could be bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's obvious that Stag already feels as long as you guys. Cheyenne already said that the fact that he even invited her on the van, that it was an automatic fail. But we have to wait, you guys, because the van was actually moving. And now it's just time to go ahead and confirm it. Like, really just just you said what? You said five. What Wait, 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 Hey, bro, I get this camera on my face. I'm my daddy, bro. Hey, bro, I don't like you. Hey, bro, I don't like you. So you guys, unfortunately, being that we was at a five-star hotel, hotel security came down and told us we had to move because we had no permission to be filming there and Stag was causing a big scene and things kind of got out of hand. Unfortunately, I cannot show it because this video kept going yellow, you guys, and I had to edit most of these clips out. Maybe I'll start a Patreon later on down the line. Look for that in the description down below. If you enjoyed this video, man, until next time, jump off. Man, I get up the skull. That's serious. Mm. See y'all on that one, man. It's all good, though. Okay, man, man. Go, sit down.